What it do, man? It's your boy Battle Truth coming to you live and direct from the Battle Truth headquarters. I call this one right here the Death Blow. See, they're finna kill all this controversy. See, when you pop in real stuff, ain't no way you can get around it. I'm finna show. I'm finna separate the real from the fake, and let me show you what I mean. Now he's saying he came up with Kill Shot. He had it before me, right? Then he put up his little clip things of him rapping. To prove it, even though nobody knew of him like that three years ago. Let's just keep, we in the battle rap community, right? We in the battle rap community, y'all, right? Three years ago, what did y'all know about D.I. the Handyman, the battle rap community? Let's keep it real. What, what did y'all know about him? What did y'all, what did y'all know about him? Now, his inner circle may know about him and people around where he at, but what did the battle rap community know of him? And what he was doing and the moves he was making. How big was he? The brother just did his first URL PG a month ago. But this the killer right here. This is how y'all know he be watching my stuff and doing and, 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 and copying my stuff and what I be doing. First he tried to say he don't watch me. He not subscribed to me. But then earlier this year, he was talking about how he do watch me a lot. But watch this. I've been here three years. Ain't no way he going to get around this. Now, I've been doing the kill shot for three years, right? He posted his kill shot and put in the date. Oh, this was 2017, 2016, December 2016. <laughs> Whatever, bro. You the one in control of the computer. But here's my thing. Regarding to what? Like I said, it's a stupid argument. But you're not finna underplay me. And he went as far as talking about I have to show him homage. I have to show him homage and don't steal his stuff and all that. That's how you know that what he was doing was a lie and what he was saying was fake. Here it is right here. We had that blogging war. Everybody in battle rap knew about it. It was nothing but kill shots going back and forth, back and forth. I started it, innovated it, and then the bloggers who I was giving kill shots with, they were returning them with the same titles on them. Kill shots, kill shots. Shots were firing from everywhere. Everybody was involved. Piper Boy was involved. Angry Fan was involved. Vodafly was involved. Jim was involved. Rome DMV was involved. A, uh, 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 fan point of view was involved. Drama House was involved. Everybody was involved, basically. Then it spawned and spiraled. 12 new bloggers come to the platform. Hip, uh, 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 I Smoke Hip Hop was involved. Slim Cody on them all was involved. Everybody know this. Let me ask y'all this question. Where was any man? You think of all these kill shots going around everywhere. Where was any man? Why didn't he say nothing? Why didn't he address it? He couldn't say it wasn't making no noise. It wasn't effective. It uh, 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 that it wasn't popping. Why wasn't he addressing it? Why? Where was he at? Did we even know him? Did we even hear him? Where was he at? Think about that. During the time it was at its highest height. Where was he at? Where was he at? Why wasn't he saying nothing? You would figure if you came out with it and everybody's using it, he would say something about it like, oh, man, he, he running with my stuff. I'm liking it. But he couldn't. He didn't. He had to been watching, though, y'all, right? He in battle rap. He been there for four years. His channel say four years. So he been here for four years. He in battle rap. We know how. Look, this thing got so big. Beasley came out and spoke against it. Smack came out and spoke against it. Jay Black came out and spoke against it. ARP came out and spoke against it. Uncle Ra came out and spoke against it. Hip Hop is Real came out and spoke against it. Um, everybody, for the most part, who had platforms and things spoke against it. Why? Because it was taken away from their business. It was taken away from their views. It was taken away from their 
what they was doing. Because everybody was focused on the heated attention we was dropping. And it was running battle rap for like six months straight. Six months closing to a year straight. Non-stop. Non-stop. Many people were talking about it. To the point they tried to do... <laughs> Restore, restore and order, restoring back order. All that spiral debt behind that. Where was he at though, y'all? For a person to have this, invented this, and it came from him, you would figure he should have been at the forefront of it. He was nowhere mentioned involved in it at all. Nowhere at all. Now the no way it comes up, pop up when I do it again. Oh, that's mine. What? Am I lying or not, y'all? That's facts. If anybody been here, been watching, that's facts. That's facts. That's facts. Ain't no way to get around it. They have kill shots dedicated to me. The people I was rivaling with have kill shots dedicated to me. Literally. I smoke, fan point of view, drama house, Slim Cody on them had. We were... We was all in it. Mostly all the bloggers was in it. And everybody know. That's what people talking about. They know it come like, he coming with kill shot. We going to give him some back. But where was he at, y'all? The guy who invented it. The guy who branded it. The guy who made it big and known and popular. Where was he at? Where was he at? And it made, look. And blogging ain't been the same since. Blogging ain't never been this entertaining ever before. Before that arrival. Before that battle truth arrival. Let's just keep it real. We had Angry Fan, Jay Black, Chris Unbiased. Those were the pioneers. Those were the pioneers. Pioneers. But for the most part, they laid back. This birthed a whole nother era of controversy and drama. And it sparked the hype of battle rap blogging forever. And it was known as the era of the kill shots. The kill shot eras. But he was nowhere to be heard. Nowhere to be found. Nobody never even mentioned him. How? If it's yours and you had it and you branded it and you were doing it. Where was you at? In the era of it. Where? Where? Why is it coming up now? Am I lying, people? Let, let's keep it Am I lying? You had to been sit. Look, and if you know battle rap, you had to been watching it. You had to been sit back and watching it. You had to been listening to it. You had to been watching it and listening to it. Why didn't you speak up? Why didn't you say nothing? He didn't come in for good or bad. He didn't speak on the good or the bad. So what does that say? What did that say? Then who, then who was the one branding it then? If he wasn't speaking out saying nothing, good or bad, nobody mentioned him. Neither is he speaking about it. So who was the one branding it? Who was doing all the branding of it then? Now, everybody know me and Piper Boy, we have our differences, right? We have our differences. Everybody know that. But you know what I found amazing? I found this to be amazing right here. Not amazing, but I found this to be amazing. I look under the comments of what everybody's saying, and lo and behold, look, this the sun dude, and has drink, the sun dude, yep, he agreed to it, yep, battle truth. Sun dude. But guess who else in the comment? Right here. Piper Boy Williams. The real Piper Boy Williams. Click this on. Go right to his channel. The real Piper Boy Williams. And what is he saying? He come right in. And he clearly let it be known. Because you got to keep in mind, we all was involved. Everybody was involved. Look, Piper Boy Williams. 
Battle Truth invented the kill shot in battle rap. Battle Truth invented the kill shot in battle rap. He got 26 likes, no thumb down. Piper Boy Williams. Now, me and this brother been at odds with each other for like the past year. He never really come on my channel and comment and say something. Why would he do it now? Then I got the call from Three Letter Man yesterday. Said the same thing. Like people asking me who did the kill shot. I'm like, that's true stuff. Son, dude, everybody know that. You're not going to get nobody to agree with that. I don't care what clips you put up, what Geechee just said. When I was doing that, Geechee, Geechee wasn't even, well, Geechee probably was just maybe making it seem. Come on, man. Just because they sit and had a drink with you and y'all done met each other at battles. Of course, they supposed to say that now. But the fact remains, where was you at in the height of the kill shot era? You do know we had a kill shot era. Every, all the everybody was involved. Everybody, unbiased. Jay Black, everybody was involved. Jay Black spoke out against it. Come on, y'all. We got we got to get back to battle rap. Let's go. Why? That's how effective it was. Look, look how effective it is now. Look, Di, listen. You know, <laughs> brother. You you know what? I know what's going on. I can't even be. I, I'm not even mad at you, brother. I'm not even mad at you, brother. I'm not even mad at you. Because I'm at the point now in this, I understand why people do what they do. I'm not even mad at you, brother. I, I, I'm just keeping it. I'm disappointed. I, I would say that I'm very disappointed in you because I expected better. I expected, especially when you carrying this badge of realness. I expect it better. But I can't even get mad at you, bro. I can't even get mad at you, bro. You know what I'm saying? And I'm not going to even try to put you down, do all that stuff. That don't even mean nothing to me, bro. I don't even care. But you can't underplay me, bro. And you can't speak as if I'm some lame dude, man, that's not innovative, that people don't know about, just because you sitting at the table with them dudes. But do you know the same people you sitting at the table with wish I could be at the table with them? Do you not know that? Do you not know that? People respect and recognize true talent. Real talk. Don't you know that? Even you would do the same thing. You can't even be man enough to say out of your mouth, you would turn me down if me and you ever talk. You know you would be lying. You know you would be lying. I expect for you to say what you're saying right now. Because I know your call to duty. But let me tell you something that's a real dude. Don't be a flunky. Don't be a sin off for nobody, bro. If anything, do it on your own. Because coming to help and do that Superman stuff, come on, fam. You should be older than that. More wiser, more mature, more respectable than that. We fight our own wars and battles. That's just real talk. I respect it better when it's done that way. But I know what this life does. But I get, but I'm telling you what's real. They won't deny me. If me and Beasley talk, if if I humble myself and I call Beasley and I talk to Beasley, that man ain't gonna say no to me. He know I got a lot to offer, a lot to give. They copying my stuff right now. That new URL app, that's patent after my point system. The same exact way that point system is in that app, that's mine. I did that when I came here and been doing it ever since. That's a fact. I'm looking at people even sending it to me like, truth, this your point system. They got your point system and stuff. I'm like, I know I saw that. It's okay. I get them a lot of game, they take it. I give away so much game, it ain't even funny. I talk to them, brother, they ain't going to turn me down. Norbs called my phone and even told me. He said, hey, I got some stuff I got cooking up, such and such. I want you to be a part of. I'm, you remember that, Norbs? Do you remember that? You can never say I'm a clown. You can never say I'm a sucker. Because that's something that got to be proven.
Anybody can talk it. You got to prove that. That and it'll never be proven because I stamp it with my blood and my life. Ain't nobody been able to say it now, and they not gonna say it. They not gonna say it. They ain't said it then. They not gonna say it now. You think they finna say it now? You think you gonna be the one that make? It? That's not gonna happen. I'm sorry, it's not gonna happen ever. See, when you actually stand up for something, and it's really true in you. That's what you're willing to die for. That's what you're willing to die for. And that's what guys are have to do to me, fam. Before I ever be uh, uh, tagged as a hoe out here on these streets, you got to kill me, man. Before I even let a person put, I, like I said, I'm 45 years old, fam. You're not going to be busting my lip, busting my nose, swelling my eye, jumping. That's not going to happen. I'm sorry, and God forbid, and thank you, it ain't nothing. That's not going to happen. It's not going to happen. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't came too far in my life to ever let that happen to me. That's not going to happen. These people, man, when they sitting back, man, I know this the internet. I know sometimes brothers do the things they do, but man, let's just keep it real, fam. You can't, you can't sun me. You can't hold me. You can't check me. You're not going to make me look like an idiot. You're not going to. No, that's not going to happen. You're not going to challenge my mind to think you're smarter than me. No, you're not going to do that. You're not going to do that. It's not going to happen. It's not going to happen. I'm sorry. It's just not going to happen. I just pop real stuff that people can't get around. If it was really yours and you branded it, where was you during the kill shot era that actually just even <laughs> happened last year even at that? Where was you? And why when everybody channel was getting deleted behind that and stuff like that, you wasn't you wasn't involved in that. Piper Boy channel, Angry Fan channel, Three Letter Man channel, my channel, Rome DMV, Black Compass. What 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 was going on? Fan point of view, all the striking and all that stuff came from behind the kill shots. That's how that's that wave was crazy, very effective, and everybody wanted to be a part of it. And this what's happening now. It got the same effect and wave. When I first was doing stuff, blowing up big, all the popularity, people talking about me. Man, that new blogger, man. That's how, look, that's how Unbiased opened up the can. If y'all remember, remember that? Unbiased was doing fan mail. Thank you, son. Remember Unbiased was doing fan mail? And then one of the fans supposed to say, what do you think of that new blogger battle truth? Then Chris was like, you know, you know, a lot of people think he's funny, this and that. I don't really think he's funny. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. That opened up that can. That was the first kill shot. Bang! You get what I'm saying? Come on now. When I did that, it was crazy. It was like, dang! Dude, it was a wrap from that point on. From that point on, everybody was involved in it. My thing is, where were you? Where were you? It ain't stopped ever since. The only reason why it stopped, because people channel started getting deleted. And I even did a blog about it. I'm like, no, I ain't doing the kill shot stuff no more, man. Brothers deleting channels, all that stuff. No. No. Then you, I don't know, or maybe you, you, see, that's what I'm saying. See, you were here, so you had to been watching. You had to been paying attention. You saw how big it was. Everybody talking about it. But you never showed your face to mention or speak out about it or nothing. But you were here in battle rap. You can't say you it, it, it went under the radar and you wasn't aware of it. To say that, that meant you wasn't in battle rap. To say you never heard me do the kill shot, you didn't see the wave, and everybody that was involved in it, and everybody speaking out against it, that's to say you was not really in battle rap and paying attention. But that's not the case with you. Because according to you, you've been here. You've been watching. You've been paying attention. And you're a battle rapper. So when it was all going on in a way, where were you at? Why you ain't on record saying nothing? See what I'm saying? See how you can't get around these facts? These real truths and facts you can't get around with. Why none of the bloggers agree with you? Who control the media? Who know everything going on in battle rap? Why none of them ain't agreeing with you? Piper Boy is like, 
And, 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 and I'm just throwing this out here, Piper Boy, bro. I ain't trying to start nothing with you. But Piper Boy is one of my biggest enemies in battle rap. I don't look at him as being an enemy because I ain't got nothing against him. I hope I ain't even got no enemies because I don't like that. You get what I'm saying? But Piper Boy, even admitting it. No. Look at that. What did he say? Battle Truth invented the kill shot in battle rap. Even he's sitting back watching like, you know what? I might not like him, but I'm going to keep it real. He did invent that. Sun dude. Enhanced dream saying the same thing. Look, look what they saying. Everybody know this. You thought you, you thought you was gonna get away with that. Look at him right here, son, dude. Yeah, I remember hearing kill shot from you first, especially seeing as though you tried to do a week of them on me. Henny man content is great, but I just gotta keep it real. And let's click in and see if this really him. Click on the icon. Yeah, that's really him. That's his channel. See what I'm saying? Everybody know that, fam. Everybody know that. I don't know what made you think you was going to get away. It don't matter what clips you put up, what nobody say. Everybody know. Where was you at during the era when we was making it rain? Everybody was involved. Every Was you even blogging then? Everybody was involved. Everybody was involved. And even though you may have said it in your battles, no disrespect to you, brother. When I say I don't watch your battles, that don't mean I'm saying you weak. That don't mean I'm saying you trash, brother. I just never really watched them. I never watched. I, I can't look. I remember you rapping against Verb, but I don't remember nothing you really said. Because I looked at you as just being one of them guys who paid top tier to help your platform grow. And I just wanted to hear Verb. And after Verb rap, I didn't really care what you said. You get what I'm saying? Now, all I'm saying is, even if you said it in your raps, I never heard you before. I never watched it. I never heard it. You get what I'm saying? I know where it comes from, from me, from us. You know what I'm saying? And like you said, street talk. Maybe people saying kill shot all over the world. Maybe so. But I know when it comes to this battle rap, brandiness, and why I know, that always been me. Why you think it's effective now with me? Why you think it's effective now with me? I would. I really wouldn't even been addressing this like this. But you tried to even take it a step further. Dude, you tried to insult my intelligence. You tried to roast me and disrespect me. You can never call me a clown, dude. I'm a real man, brother. You can never say I'm soft. I'm a real man, brother. Nobody, nobody will say that who know me personally. Nobody says that who know me personally. You don't know me. So for you to say that, you out of pocket, bro. Check yourself. Check yourself. You out of pocket, fam. Stop trying to come at me to think you're going to make yourself look tough and real. Don't do that, man. Don't do that. That make you look bad, bro. That make you look bad. If I dressed and said something to anybody, they should be man enough to defend themselves without you having to say nothing to open your mouth. Or unless you a flunky. Unless you're saying you a flunky in a sent off. Other than that, if I said something about Queen Flip, he didn't like Flip as his own man. If I said something about Beasley, Smack, they are their own man. Battle rappers, they are their own man. That ain't all men. And if you got to take up to defend another man, what do that say about that man? I don't need nobody doing my dirt for me. And if I put it out there, I'm man enough to accept every consequence that come with it. So I'm very disappointed in you, bro. Then you try to disrespect me, even though, look, you try to disrespect me, fam. Thinking that that's funny. That ain't funny, man. But I'm real enough to know you don't know no better, dog. You don't know no better. So you can say what you want. And you serving as a bad example to be somebody who's supposed to be an OG and respected dude where you from. That's a bad example. That's nothing but straight up hate and jealousy. No matter how you look at it, the facts weigh in my favor, not your favor. And the evidence of it is your actions and the things you're saying out of your mouth. 
I never once disrespected you, but you tried to disrespect me. You out of pocket, player. But I'm so used to clowns trying to come at me and say things. This ain't no different. Just another battle troop wave. I wonder if I didn't do that flip, that video on Queen Flip, and it ain't almost at 10,000 views now. What would people, would this really be going on? Yeah, right. And what was my reason for even addressing the Queen Flip thing? Because he lied on me. I don't just throw stuff out there. He lied on me, man. Battle rap is a negative sport anyway. Ain't nothing really good in it. Everything negative. Everybody talking against everybody, all that stuff like that. That's what it is. That's what it is. This is the energy that's out here, man. But I'm finna do some do some different things. I'm finna change some of this narrative, man. You know, I'm finna change some of this narrative out here that's out here on here. Since I see I'm an innovator, I'm a trendsetter. I can do things a little different and show some things. I'm very disappointed in you, bro. I expected more from you. But since I cleared up my name again, and thank you for everybody out there keeping it real and true, even though y'all probably don't even rock with me, at least y'all was honest enough to tell the truth. I appreciate all y'all on that for uh, uh, keeping it real on that. But the brother was out of pocket. He did some crazy stuff, man. And it is what it is, man. Other than that, I just put the facts out there. And they lay where they lay, man. I put the facts out there. They lay where they lay. Um, <laughs> It's your boy Battle Truth, man. It ain't my judgment that's in question. It's yours. Something you can't get around. Where were you at? Doing our era of the kill shots when everybody was involved. Why didn't you say nothing? Where was you at? Why didn't you say anything? You can't answer it. You can't say you didn't you didn't see it. Everybody was involved and everybody spoke out and talked about everybody. But you, and for you to be the one that branded it had, why wouldn't you say nothing? So you can't get around that at all. That's battle truth. It ain't my judgment that's in question. It's yours. This ain't a kill shot. You're just a leg injury with a Dillinger. You're just a leg injury 